For issues where your quick jet is not drawing product, you'll want to check your glass barrel to see if it's cracked, the glass barrel housing to make sure it's threaded down tightly, the inlet check valve housing to make sure it's threaded down tightly, and the output check valve to make sure that's threaded down tightly. If all those are good, the next thing to check, and most of the time it's one of these two issues, is your output check valve, the ball bearing and spring are stuck open, or your inlet check valve, ball bearing and spring are stuck closed. And we're gonna go through troubleshooting it, mainly the lack of drawing product in. So you can see that the glass barrel is not filling, there's no product coming through the tube. So we're gonna check the inline check valve and the output check valve. To check the inline check valve, we're gonna remove the tube. Uh, I'm initially going to take some three-in-one oil and drop it, put a drop of it down into the check valve. And then I'm gonna take one of the Allen wrenches that comes in your kit and slide it through and just press down gently against the ball. You can see um, I have loosened it because it's actually pushing, the, the spring's pushing it back up and out. In which case, I'll take the tube, reattach it, give it a few squeezes, see if that's made the difference, and it hasn't. Uh, so next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the same thing with the output check valve. So to do that, you wanna thread off the entire piece uh, that's past the glass barrel. How comes the spring? How comes the ball bearing? So I'm gonna do the same. Drop of that down there. I'm gonna take the ball bearing, drop it back in. Take the spring, put that back in there. And then thread this back on. You wanna make sure that the spring sits right inside where the threads are. And we'll give it a squeeze. All right, so going through that, now uh, there's some fluid moving through. It takes a few squeezes to start drawing it through. Look, now the product's getting to the glass barrel, and now it's filling the tube. Just one last trick to try for uh, getting product to draw through to your device. Uh, simply, all you have to do is cut a fresh end onto your tube. About a quarter, in, quarter of an inch is all it really takes.